Okay, so I watched Thor Ragnar yesterday, um, November 8th, 2017. It is such a good movie. Like, compared to the other Thor, there's nothing, like, the other Thor is, compared to it, it's trash. The only thing that I didn't really like, is, like, in these scenes, is, um, like, how Hulk was acting, but, like, I kind of, I don't know. I kind of liked it, but I didn't at the same time. Um... I think it was kind of odd how Hulk was acting in these scenes. Especially since they just fought, like, right before. Um, but, yeah. And, like, um, the movie, like, the trailers, you thought it was all, all be about Hulk and, and Thor fighting. But it's, like, not even close about that, about them fighting. It's about them fighting the sister. And then at first, it's, it's in, like, them, like, being friends again and stuff like that. So this is... Thor and Loki's sister, um, and yeah, she's, she, ba she, she didn't kill Odin, I think, but Odin just died, because, like, maybe he's, like, too old or something, I don't know, but he died, Odin died, and then, and then she, we don't know for sure if she dies on the end, because at the very beginning, Thor kills this lava monster, let's see if I can find it right here, Thor kills this lava monster, at the very beginning of the movie, and then he has this crown, and then, Loki, he goes and, and reborns the lava monster and makes it alive again. Um, so then they can all leave. Everyone from Asgard can leave. And then whoever wants the island, whoever wants Asgard more can fight for it. Um, but basically she like looks like it looks like she dies. And then the world blows up anyway, so the most likely this guy dies too. But apparently Odin killed him a long time ago, but he came back to life or something, or Odin never killed him. Um, see, it, it was such an awesome movie. It was like, like kind of funny and stuff like that. Where's this Rocky? There's Meek. There's a guy named Meek. Um, and the Rocky. I can't remember the Rocky. Meek is like some like bug or something. Oh yeah, this guy. Let's talk about this guy first. He, I hated how like he, he came up on the on the ship, right? And afterwards, he got um, Dis and Troy. He got them out, and then he started shooting those, uh, like, they kind of look like Emerald dudes, but they're, like, following soldiers from a long time ago. And the reason why they're following um, the girl, the sisters, because they thought they, they know they died, I guess. And then they just, you know, they just followed her because she was the leader of them before they died. Um, um, but anyways, he, there's no redemption for this guy. He, he deserved to die, and I think he kind of knew that too, like, for fighting for Thor, I mean, for Ragnar, like, with his two guns. I don't know where he got them, but, I don't know where he got them, but anyways, yeah, he deserved to die. He, there was, I knew they were going to do, like, a thing like him, like, redemption thing. No, there's no redemption for that guy. He, he's a traitor, he's a, he's a coward, he, there's no redemption for him. He could have been, like, one of these other guys dying, but no. She killed him anyways, but. Yeah, there's no redemption for him. So we got a tear cut. She's a Valkyrie. Um, I can't remember her name. And Loki. Loki was like kind of funny, but predictable at the same time. And um, yeah, it was it was funny like how it, like went in this room, so it throws a thing at him to see if if he's like a hologram or not. But he's not a hologram. And then the end, the end is like, uh, in the end. After, like, the meek is dead thing, but then meek actually comes back to life. There's, um, a little thing with, uh, Thor and Loki talking. And, um, and, um, Thor throws something at him, and then Loki catches it, and then Thor's, like, have to make sure that you're not, like, a hologram or something like that. He, he said something like that. Oh, yeah, this guy came back. He was missing. Can't remember his name. Um, maybe it's Idris or something. I don't know. He was missing, but he came back. Um, the the guy that said had no there's no redemption for he took his place, um, because he was banished by at the very beginning, not at the very beginning, but it didn't show him get banished. But he was already banished by Loki because Loki was pressed pretending to be Odin, and he made the guy that said had no redemption, there's no redemption for the in charge of what his job was. So he was an outcast and he just left. Um. Yeah, this was an awesome movie. I loved it. It was um, Thanos' gauntlet, but 
uh, to where his sister said it was fake, though. Okay, comment down below, below who would you rather, would you rather be the god of thunder? Um, the god of, the goddess or god of death? Uh, would you rather be the god or goddess of thunder? Um, these are the, like, the dead soldiers that came back. The goddess or god of death or the goddess or god of thunder or the goddess or god of mischief? I'd rather be, um, a god of mischief. Please. There's no outline for you, right? You don't, there's no, like, they already know, sure no one trusts, trusts you, but, um, they know that there's no outline for you, like, and you, you don't have a set plan, like, they're not going to tell you to do something really important. Well, they could, but they, they still know that you might disappoint them, because, you know, you're the guy of Um, I, I think it'd just be fun and just, you know, just like keeping people into like that sure it's bad, but sometimes you gotta do some vigilante um good stuff. Don't know if they're gonna be bad or good. Stanley was of course in the movie. He was like a like a hair cutter, he cut through his hair. Um I can't find the rock dude in week. I think those two are the best of the movie. I hope if they do another one, they um Rocky and Luger at the minute. Oh, she didn't have a name. Her name was just Valkyrie. Oh, okay. Because like I never said her name in this one. Times in Manamo BC. Canada BC. Yeah, because I never said her name. She said Valkyrie. So. Down here. I don't see him. Oh, uh, they. I think that's him. Maybe. Oh yeah, and Thor's hammer gets destroyed by his sister when she first comes. <clears throat> Thor looks really cool right here. Um. Thor so Ragnarok. Well. Yeah. That guy in skin Oh, there he is. Korg. Oh, Korg is an actual like Marvel character. It makes sense. This is him, and he's a good guy. I really like Korg. What is this? It looks like Thor and some black dude. <clears throat> Maybe the same species as Korg. I don't remember this in any movie though, but. I guess it's a movie. Corey. Corey is a fictional, ca fictional character appearing in an American comic book. Published by Marvel Comics, created by writer Greg Park. Unpacked in Artists of Carlo Aguilian. The character first appeared in the Incredible Hulk, Volume 293, during the Planet Hulk storyline. Okay. Yeah. So he looks really cool. Corey. Alright, anyways, hope you guys did enjoy. Subscribe, like, for more, and this out. So she can take a few seconds for him to go. Come on. Come on. We can do this. Peace out. Well, this is a long review.